Let's create a fireball cannon effect in Blender using particle systems and fire. We'll start with a UV sphere, just like in the other fire tutorials. Add an icosphere, which will act as our particle object. Now select the UV sphere, go to the Particles tab, and add a new system. Set the number of particles as needed. In the Render section, change it to Object and choose the icosphere. Then, in the Velocity section, Tweak the X and Z values so the particles shoot forward like cannonballs. Next, select the UV sphere and add a quick smoke effect. Switch to edit mode and resize the domain to fit the fire animation. With the sphere selected, go to the physics tab. Change the flow type to fire plus smoke. For flow source, pick particle system and select the one we just created. Increase the fuel value to make the flame stronger and more intense. Now select the domain. In the Physics tab, enable Adaptive Domain. Under Fire, increase the reaction speed to 1 for faster burning. Raise the resolution for more detail, but be careful. Higher resolution takes longer to bake and uses more memory. In the Cache section, set Type to All so it bakes both fire and noise. Then hit Bake All. This may take some time. Once baking is complete, we'll move on to shading.